for St. Francis Healthcare's House Calls TV. Do you know when you had your last tetanus shot? Dr. Tom Feely explains why this vaccination is so important and how often you need to have your shot. Tetanus occurs through an infection or a wound. What happens is the spores are, are usually in dirt. The spores get into wounds, they change into the bacteria with the dead skin and then release toxins which go to the nervous system in the body. These toxins cause symptoms like irritability, increased heart rate, along with muscle spasms and rigidity in the neck and jaw, known as lockjaw. But you can protect yourself. Anytime you get a puncture wound or a wound that's infected with dirt or soil, you need to clean it out and then go see your doctor to review your tetanus immunization. It's important to keep your immunization up to date by getting booster shots on schedule. It is most important that patients stay up to date with their tetanus vaccines, uh, which includes getting a tetanus vaccine, whether you've had a cut or wound, every 10 years. For more information, call 402CARE. And for more House Calls TV, go online to rsfh.com. I'm Angela May. Roper St. Francis Healthcare's House Calls TV.